Texas Governor Greg Abbott sounds alarm. He says uh, Camilla will make Biden's failed border policy look good. Wow. I wouldn't doubt that. I would not doubt that at all because she first is incompetent. Um, but second, she will she want they want the border wide open. This is part of the Democrat plan. They want another voting block. Um, this is the George Soros plan, like I said earlier. Um, they, this is what they want. So, of course, it is going to after they get up, it, God forbid, if they win and get another four years, you think it's bad now. <laughs> Woo. Once they get ha once they get that that um that that second uh that second term basically Biden's second term, um Obama's uh <laughs> fourth term, <laughs> um and it will be it will be uh it will be chaos and again this is the plan, um so we're gonna talk about it we're gonna hear uh, Greg Abbott's take on it um but before we get started go ahead and hit that like button share this out so we can get this information out there subscribe if you're not already a subscriber and hit that alarm bell so you know when I'm putting out new stuff. Also, check out my link tree in the description. It has a link to my Patreon. That's where I talk about things that I can't talk about here. Um, there's also a link to my X account um, as well. So follow me on X. I be on X all the time, putting out a bunch of news and stuff and reposting stuff there as well. All right, so let's talk about this news. Now, this comes from Margaret Flav uh, Flavin from um, the Gateway Pundit. Wow, this is my second article that um, I'm going over from her today. So good for her with some, some great, great articles. Um, but she reports that Texas Republican Governor uh, Greg Abbott appeared uh, on Sunday Morning Futures with Maria Bonaroma to sound the alarm about what will happen at the border if incompetent border czar Camilla Harris is elected president. Wow, they, she's, she calls her incompetent as well. Again, I haven't read this article yet. I haven't checked out the um, Abbott's take or anything. It's just, you know, when I, most of the time when I go over these articles, I'm looking at it for the first time. I mostly just read the headline and, and say, let's... Let's see what this article about, and I, I share it with y'all, and with my thoughts. Is most of the time is live reactions, um, but yeah, we we all know that Camilla Harris is incompetent. <laughs> but Abbott told Bartiromo that if Harris is elected president, her disastrous border policy would make illegal immigration far worse than it currently is. "Quote: Making Biden's border policy actually even look good." Wow, that's that's hard to believe. Um, so yeah, let's let's get let's get right to this clip here and get his take on it. Here we go. All right. So you can expect what she's done as vice president. You can expect what she uh, articulated when she first ran for president, uh, and that is uh, she she supports eliminating illegal immigration as a crime. She she supports giving magnet drawing immigration policies such as free health care uh, to people crossing the border. Uh, she w w believes in a uh, limit. So think about that. <laughs> we have all this expensive private, you know, health care is expensive and it gets worse every time each year with our private uh, health care. It gets worse. It gets worse. They're giving illegal immigrants free health care <laughs> while our premiums are going up. Um, again, I'm not for universal health care or anything like that, because um, as a veteran and being to the V.A., my, my old lady's a veteran as well, and she uses the VA. I can tell you that it's terrible, terrible service. It's um, ration care, and no one would actually want that. Um, so I'm not for universal health care, but that being said, illegal immigrants are coming into this country and receiving free health care while we got people that, that can't even afford re um, uh, regular, uh, regular checkups. This is crazy. Eliminating ICE. Uh, this would be the most destructive uh, border policy ever, making Biden's border policy actually even look good. And, and so as bad as illegal immigration is already, it will be far worse under a Harris administration. Yeah, and, and you know, they're boasting about the fact that the numbers are down from the highs. I mean, at the highs, what we were talking about, 8,000 people a day coming through the border there in Texas. But those numbers are down. What we don't talk about is the fact that oftentimes they're down because this administration has decided to start flying them in right they're, they're putting them Facts. on planes flying them to swing states across the country well you are true but let's be clear about something else so they're, they're claiming that the, the numbers are down because of biden's executive order in june 
the, the reality is because of action that Texas took, they began yep. going down last year. Right. Uh, and it be, because Texas represents two thirds of the border, because we reduced illegal immigration by about 85 percent in the state of Texas, of, of course, uh, the border numbers are going to be down. But you mentioned Thanks. something else that not enough Americans know, and, and that is another reason why the, the crossings at the border are down is because Biden is flying them across the border and then uh, 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 moving them uh, to cities across the entire United States. Extraordinary. Simply extraordinary. Human trafficking. He is literally human trafficking. The government, um, the Joe Biden regime, Camilla Harris regime, regime are literally trafficking people into this country and um, giving them handouts. This is crazy. So um, the reality is because of the action that Texas took, they began going down last year because Texas represents two thirds of the border, um, he said, and, and, and it's true. Um, so that's why the numbers are actually going down and they're flying more people in to this country. This is human trafficking. This should be illegal, Our state sponsored human trafficking. Um, and, and nothing is going to happen to them. And it's going to double, you can guarantee they're going to um, double those efforts. God forbid if uh, Camilla Harris become president. But y'all let me know what y'all think about this. Leave your comments down below. Like, share, and subscribe. And uh, check out JJDisciplePsychotherapist.com for the latest in news. Until next time, peace.